In this short video, we will show you how to install the Epson SureColor T-Series print software and configure the default print driver settings. Included with the printer is a user guide binder. Inside of the binder is a setup guide that shows how to assemble and configure the printer, a warranty document, and a CD with the printer software for both Mac and Windows computers. Insert the CD into the computer and run the setup program. If the computer asks if you wish to run the setup program, choose Yes. Select the printer model that you have purchased and click Next. The setup wizard will appear. It's recommended to close any programs that you have running at this time. When you're ready to proceed, click Next. Review the end user software license agreement and once satisfied, click Accept. Now we'll choose what software to install. For Microsoft Windows users, the SureColor T-Series printers includes a job accounting tool that helps track and manage printer usage, as well as a Microsoft Office print plugin that turns Word, Excel, and PowerPoint documents into posters with a click of a button. If you do not wish to install either of these software items, simply uncheck them. For this video, we are just going to install the print driver software and utilities. Click the Install button to continue. The print driver software is installed first, and once complete, you'll be asked how the printer is connected. If it's on a network, simply click OK to begin. Otherwise, if you're connected by USB, select No USB Connection, and then choose OK. It will search the network for your SureColor T-Series printer and show a list of results. Choose your printer from the list, and then click OK. The software will configure the connection and display a message. Click OK to continue. The printer's utility software called Remote Panel 2 will be installed next. This utility makes it easy to update the printer's firmware and perform several other maintenance tasks. Once completed, click the Exit button. You'll be asked to register your printer. This only takes a moment to do and ensures quick access to technical support. Click Next and follow the information on the screen. For now, we're going to skip this step by clicking on Cancel, but we will set a reminder. Now that the printer software is installed, Let's configure the print driver default settings. This will save you a lot of time going forward, especially if you print the same type of drawings or images at a specific size. To do this, open the Start menu and then click on Devices and Printers. Right-click on your newly installed SureColor T-Series printer and select Printing Preferences. Upon opening the Printing Preferences, the software will talk to the printer to determine the paper type and source automatically. Review the media settings and choose the type of paper that you'll use typically. Next, we'll want to choose the default paper size that we'll print. Checking the option Fit to Roll Paper With will automatically enlarge or reduce a document to fit to the roll paper width. We'll now choose a print mode for everyday use. Poster, Illustration, and Text mode will produce bolder colors and crisp text, while Poster Photo mode will reproduce colors naturally. Office Document mode will sharpen up an image for enhanced clarity and can be chosen in black only or full color mode. The CAD line drawing mode will produce crisp fine lines precisely at high speed. This mode is also available in a black only or a full color mode. The perspective GIS mode is great for printing maps with accurate color. And lastly, the standard image settings will produce an image with little to no image enhancements. Then we choose our default quality settings. This may vary depending on the paper type you have loaded, but usually consists of a speed, a quality, and a max quality setting. On the Layout tab, we can change the default orientation or the scale factor. Typically, it's best to leave this as is. On the Advanced Settings tab, we can change the way the paper is cut after a print, disable the Auto Rotation feature, and several other options. If you do have the optional internal print server installed, click on the Settings button to change the default way the print jobs are saved and processed. The Utilities tab has controls for printer preferences, customized settings, and printer maintenance. Click OK to save the default printer settings. If you need to print many files that will use the default print settings, here is a time-saving way to print files in batch. In the Devices and Printers window, right-click on the Epson SureColor T-Series printer and choose Set as Default Printer. Open a File Explorer window and select the files that you want to print. Then either click the Print button or right-click and then choose Print. To see similar videos or learn more about the Epson SureColor T-Series, visit us online at proimaging.epson.com.